enough was enough. After what he calls a semester of disrespect, backstabbing, lying and cheating, Erwin Horwitz had all he could take. Yesterday, I finally reached the breaking point. He sent a lengthy email to his strategic management class, explaining that they would all be failing the course. He says the students proved to be incompetent and lacked the maturity level to enter the workforce. It became apparent that they couldn't do just some of the most simple and basic things that they should have been able to do at that point. In the email, he cited examples of students cheating, telling him to chill out and inappropriate conduct. He said students spread untrue rumors about him online. And he says at one point, he even felt the need to have police protection in class. We spoke with some students who say they were shocked to get the email. John Shaw is a senior and worried this would mess up the job he has lined up when he graduates in May. It's just ridiculous because, I mean, I, I had never had a problem in the class. I thought I'd done pretty well, done pretty well in the uh, first test and every everything else is going on. And then get the email saying I'm going to get an F in the class and just kind of, uh, it was overwhelming. Horwitz says in the 20 years he's been a professor, he's never dealt with a class as disgraceful as this one. This class was unique. I have never failed a class. Uh, in fact, it's very rare that I fail students. But in this particular class, you know, sometimes learning incorporates tough love. Dr. Patrick Lucharn, the vice president of academic affairs at the university, made it very clear that although they respect Mr. Horwitz, his failing grades won't stick. None of them have failed until the end of the class meeting. The only reason a student would fail is because he or she hasn't performed the actual, um, you know, in, in, with the expectations for that particular class. We're told the department head will be taking over the class for the rest of the semester.